eyebrows. Now these underhyped features are getting some attention. People are heading to eyebrow stylists. You really want to get serious? You need to talk to this guy. I really transform women and men through the eyebrow. I think it's the most important underestimated feature of the face. LA's Damone Roberts is known as the eyebrow king. He's plucked and shaped for Beyonce, Gwyneth Paltrow, Madonna, even Robert Downey Jr. Damone has a few secrets we can try at home. The biggest mistake women tend to make with the eyebrows is they tend to over tweeze. The thicker the eyebrow, the younger and softer and prettier one tends to look. Look at my face! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Makeup is like candy. Sometimes you want a Snickers, sometimes you want three musketeers. You know, it changes. Right. So color could be your friend. I don't want to change who you are. I want to kind of clean that up, open your eye up a little bit, but in a way that I guarantee you no one will know that they've been done. How do we spot a Damone eyebrow? Yes. I don't believe in stencils, personally. I don't believe in cookie cutter eyebrows. Mm -hmm. I think it's all about the person's structure, what they have going on with their actual face, and how yeah. to make it work for them. That's important. So that's yeah. how you can tell a Damone Roberts eyebrow. It's the right shape for the individual. Hi, Momo. Welcome to We're All Gonna Die Anyway. Thank you. And it's true. We're all going to die anyway. It is true. Yeah. It's a good thing. Right. Because it's, it's, it means that we got to live our best lives and be our best selves. And That's right. Where we're here. I know. Right? It's, that's it how gives I you, take it. Me too. That's why I'm doing yeah. this. Because it gives you an urgency to live. Well, I think that's really We special. met each other as babies here in town. I know. We were so naive and green and, <laughs> we and innocent. We were such babies. Everything. We were just like, hi. <laughs> <laughs> we were. We I were know. so... I love us Innocent. then, though, when I think about it. We were yeah. so hungry, too. You were doing brows at Sager French. I was in a little room in the a size little of room. this chair, yeah. literally. And I had a line going out the door. Yeah. And I just knew there was more out I there. I know. You work and you have your own business. You just keep going and you keep going. And you don't always stop to take the time to um, no. take it in. So sometimes no. when you come across pictures or scenarios, it just makes you stop and pause. Yeah, for sure. And just realize how far you've been. It's been a long, fun journey, right? It's been a long, fun journey. There's been extreme highs and there's been extreme lows. Yeah. But we, we got through it and we're still we here. And we're still killing it. And we're still killing it. They're all after the latest beauty status symbol. What's become known around the world as the Damone Arch? I've been eyebrows for a long time. That's why the press dubbed me the eyebrow king because I, I made a lot of trials and errors until I got it right. This is Jeffrey. We don't mean to be arch, but Damone Roberts is the king of these facial features, which he's famous for shaping. Daniel, her eyebrows. Right. He was the subject of a question in Trivial Pursuit. The question is, what parts of Madonna and Laura Flynn Boyle have been plucked by Damone Roberts? And of course, the answer is the eyebrows. Eyebrows, again, are the single most important underestimated feature right. on the face. 